we are in one of the leafy suburbs of Sydney, Australia. The species responsible for building this amazing structure is called Nasuti Termes walkeri. Nasuti Termes walkeri, commonly known as tree termites, is a species of arboreal termites found in eastern New South Wales and southeastern Queensland, Australia. Why would this species build such a big nest? Where is the queen? Let's see if we find out where it is. Nasuti Termes walkeri species usually attack fence posts, poles, and timbine series. However, they usually get discovered quickly as they build their tunnels on outside the timber. They prefer hardwood to softwood. They generally attack decayed timber. If you break their tunnels, soldiers will come out to defend against the intruders. You can recognize them by their pointy heads. Luckily, one of my clients was cutting a dead tree with the same species living on it, and he kindly let me observe and film it. As you see, confused termites are trying to regroup themselves. Notice these termite drops that are running away. As you can see, termites have been eating almost the entire hardwood of the tree, particularly above their arboreal nest. As you see, this colony consists of many thousands of termites. This is a queen that used to be flying termites or allate. Perhaps she flew from another colony and landed here and started her own nest amongst the rest of the super colony. These are retained daughters or ergatoids, which are queens that emerge as adults without wings. Now, this is an interesting insect hanging out in a termite nest. It's an imposter. 
It is a caterpillar pretending to be a queen termite. Ants are termites' oldest enemies. As soon as termites' line of defense is broken, they will attack them and take them back to their colony to eat. Soldiers of these termite species are able to skirt a chemical to irritate ants' eyes. However, they are not overwhelmed by ants. Finally, ants are having a feast taking the nymphs or baby termites and also the eggs. We know in the beginning only one couple start the colony and that primary couple, queen and the king, either live under the ground or in the middle of the trunk. When the colony is big enough, they start to build this arboreal nest on top of the tree. Perhaps its purpose is to discourage other species of termites to come near it, but more importantly, it encourages other flying termites of the same species to come and join them. More kings and queens will increase the chance of survival of the colony by strengthening the breeding cycle through diversity.